All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. I just finished watching Lock and Key, and I have to say, these kids are absolutely dumb. This is something that I don't like in films or TV shows is when they make the kids and their ignorance a plot point. Um, there's so many things that could have been solved by just doing the right thing, making the right decision. So Lock and Key is a show that's on Netflix that came out in 2020 and it's about three seasons in. I currently have only finished season one and I'm working my way through season two, but I have to say I am at my mental capacity to the point to where these kids are driving me insane. I don't think I've ever watched a single TV show or movie where I yelled at the screen so much. I'm like, what are you doing? Why are you doing that? Make the right decision. And over and over and over and over again, they continue to make the wrong decision. Bodhi is the youngest one, and he is by far the worst. So the premise of the show on the surface is pretty, pretty interesting. It's actually intriguing. You know, these keys that take you to different places, these keys that control different aspects. And I thought that was an actually really good take on the supernatural. And I thought it was very interesting. And the premise of the show just makes for good entertainment when it clicks. But these, these, these kids, these kids are absolutely terrible at decision-making and critical thinking skills. So I started watching it and the, the more I got into it, the more I struggled with finishing the first season because of these kids. And as an adult, I'm like, come on, like, stop, just stop. Don't do this. This is gonna create a bigger problem than it already is. And just as I say that, I do more dumb things. And it just piles up and piles up until you get through season one and you're like, this, these kids are idiots. As of right now, I don't know if I'm gonna make it, but I do want to at least finish it for completionary purposes. So we are on episode one of season two, and I'll probably check back in with an update on this, but at the current moment, my mental state, it went from 10 to like seven in season one because of just how stupid these kids are. And this is, like I said, a plot point that's been used in multiple different uh, forms of media. But this one, whoo, this one takes the cake. I, like I said, I am at my mental capacity with this damn show and these damn kids. Speaking of idiotic kids, let me know what are some of your most annoying kids in any film. The name, the movie, leave it in the comment section below. Let's have a discussion about it because this is something that always happened. This is something that is probably gonna continue to happen. And I think it's just absolutely lazy writing. Now, like I said, the premise of the show is pretty good, but the writing has been a detriment to my enjoyment of the show. Um, I haven't looked much at the source material. As a matter of fact, I don't know anything about the source material. So also, if you guys know anything about that, leave it in the comment section. Let me know where I can find more of this stuff at to get a grasp of what I am missing compared to what the, the Netflix adaptation showed me. But um, I just, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna continue on. I'm gonna try and press through and watch the rest of the season and possibly do an update but this is this has been trying this has been absolutely trying for me um but with that said man this is a quick video i clicked on it started watching lock and key and i wanted to put my thoughts out there while i still had the mental capacity to do so but that's it for the video it's short sweet my name's lincoln this has been an rpg show until next time guys like comment sub and i'm out peace